A few days ago, a mystery seven star raid was announced and it showed us this picture right there with a the big question mark blob covering the Pokemon. So people were left to speculate, what could it be? There was a bit, it was a bit strange because the last two Pokemon that have been in seven star raids did not get this mystery treatment and they were just starters. So it turns out, we got Greninja coming! In fact, two new raid events have been announced. So, we got this one for Greninja, which is going to be the next 7 star raid. And that's going to be coming on the 27th of January and again on the 10th of February. You know, you got the two separated weeks to do this, or rather the weekends. And then it's going to be 6 IVs. It's going to have Hidden Ability Protein, alright? So it's going to be a hard one. I can't wait to see. It's going to be Poison Terra, so you can try and bring a Psychic or something, but make sure it's durable against water. I think a good option is going to actually be the Paldean Wooper, or rather the Evolved form. We don't know what moves it has yet, but we we know it's Poison type, which is weak to Crown, and we know it's going to have at least water, one water move, so I'm looking at Qu Claude Sire. I'm looking at Claude Sire to see what we can make out of this. He has water absorb he can and he has super effective moves so let's see where it goes with that this course is a major fan favorite people are super hyped that they're going to be able to finally get greninja in the game and then you'll be able to breed it again for shiny frokies additionally and coming actually first before the greninja is the dual ghost type raid den event all right these are going to be these five star raids like we've had with the tyranitar and the salamence for the first time of course it isn't a pseudo so it's just some random ghost pokemon there you go their dates are the 20th to the 23rd folks if you guys want to get a decent pokemon to handle some of these raids especially the greninja one i think the 6 iv quaxly might also be a possibly good contender i've started that giveaway yesterday you'll be able to get yourself a nice 6 iv quaxly with ability patch and that will be grown up to be really strong, all right? So you'll be able to handle a couple of raids with that one too. Go check that video out. I'll leave it here. As always, thanks for watching. Stay tuned. Look out for a new video on the build that's going to be best to handle Greninja. I always look for a build to solo it. However, I think Greninja is going to be an extra spicy, extra difficult one. So hang tight. Let's see what we can do with it. I'll see you around for the raids. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.